Hi there. I'm Lisa Taylor, and I just wanted to come on real quick and talk to you about this aha I had um, driving on the freeway yesterday. I was behind a truck driving along, and I couldn't really see. There was kind of stop and go traffic, and things would go and then stop really fast, and I couldn't really see in front of me enough to know, do I need to be stopping? So I was getting a little bit frustrated with um, not being able to see and behind the truck and behind the truck. And there are, you know, cars on my left side and cars on my right side. And I'm starting to feel kind of like, okay, I want this to change, wishing the truck would move. And then I realized, huh, I can just change lanes. So I got into the lane next to me, which actually moved along pretty quickly and passed the truck. And I thought, wow, I can see where I'm going. And I just laughed at myself because I... It made me realize how many times I do this in life where I'm stuck behind a truck getting frustrated, metaphorically speaking. And, um, you know, something in my life that I'm frustrated with or that I don't feel is getting resolved or I'm not seeing it from the right angle or whatever. And then change lanes, you know, change the basis from which I am thinking or seeing this issue. Change my perception, change to see it spiritually instead of seeing it with the five physical senses. Because as we all know, getting stuck on this plane in the five physical senses locks us into the problem. So um, change lanes, change your perception, change your basis of thought from matter to spirit. And the spiritual sense of things frees us from the limits of matter. The spiritual sense of things aligns us with what is real and what is good and what is true. And it aligns us with all the laws of the universe, all the laws of God, the law of balance, the law of alignment, the law of abundance, the law of adjustment, the law of spirit, the law of love, all of the laws of God, mind and soul and intelligence, that when we align with the law of God, with the laws of God, we have the intelligence we need. We have the ideas we need. We have the inspiration we need. We have the strength we need. We have the flexibility we need. And I love that combination of flexibility and strength. There was a guy that um, I used to study with called David Driver. He was from New Zealand and he, he uh, was a professional architect turned spiritual healer. And he had a wonderful lecture about flexibility and strength and talked about how the trees if they didn't have strength, they wouldn't be able to stand tall. And if they didn't have flexibility, they'd snap in the wind. And we're the same. Our mental, our mental agility, flexibility, and strength is the same. We need both. We need the yin and the yang, the flexibility and the strength to go forward. So that's kind of my note tonight. If you're stuck behind a truck, change lanes. If you're stuck in the material sense of things, shift into the spiritual perception of things, into the reality of who you are in spirit, and everything gets better. Okay, that's my note tonight. Love you guys. Talk to you soon. Bye.